Working for God. Working for God. That's number two. Working for God is not the same thing as knowing him. Working for God is not the same thing as knowing him. You got that? Matthew chapter 7. 21. Matthew 7. 21. Now, not everyone that saith unto me, Lord, Lord. Now, this is scary. Why? Why? Those who say he is Lord. Okay. He is Lord. Which group says Jesus is Lord? Jesus said, this is, if it was in the Bible, it's in the words of red. Not everyone that says to me, Jesus, they call me Lord. Lord. Which no one can say without the Holy Spirit. Our brothers in other religions, do they call Jesus Lord? Do atheists call uh, Jesus Lord? They didn't even say they call him Savior, like Master. Many, no, not few, not many in the world, many of those who call me Lord, that's many Christians, will say to me, Lord, Lord, not everyone says Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven, but he that doeth the will of my Father which is in heaven. Now this is also interesting. That what we are about to read that these ones who call him Lord, Lord did, that's not the will. You don't worry. You take that home. I told you meditate. Verse 22. Verse 22. Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, number one, have we not prophesied in your name? I'm talking to preachers of the word. That's right. Now, I'm not speaking to members who are not interested in sharing any word or the gospel. Or I'm talking about those who preach. Those who, those who, those who, those who speak the oracles of God. Of which we have over a thousand teachers, and many of those up to teach, up to teach. Thank you, blameless and up to teach. Yes. Number two, those who confront Satan, they cast out devils. Those who fight demonic powers, those who those who say that God is building His church and the gates of hell cannot prevail. Those who say Satan, get thee behind me. Those who say I rebuke you, Satan. Those who through the finger of God cast out devils. That's the second group. Talking about working for him. Preachers, deliverance ministers, people who cast out devils. Then, this is that one I like. Anything that's a wonderful work, that's done for me. All those. Now, this includes airport stars, ushers, singers, dancers, successful bassing for four weeks in a row. <laughs> it's a wonderful work. Hitting swollen Sunday targets. It's a wonderful work. Uh, uh, instrumentalists, uh, singing beautifully, playing instruments, playing grand piano, playing drums, uh, tra not transposing. Not tra it's a wonderful work to not transpose. Uh, those who work in bishops, admins, bishops, admins, administrators of bishops. And who else? Arrivals, uh, arrivals, people who help with arrivals. Uh, all these people, area one workers, all, all, <laughs> all area one workers, online church members, all of them who are doing many wonderful works in my name. They did it for me. Next verse. Next verse. I will profess to them. I never knew you. I'm talking to pastors. Those who hold. Uh, show, ah, Thank you. Holy Spirit, you are great. I want to talk to preachers now. Oh, this is going to be exciting. Look. look. Jeremiah 2.8. Jeremiah 2.8. The priest said not. Where is the Lord? And those who handle the law, they didn't know me. This one, those who do this, he doesn't know me. He's, you know, let's, let's go to Ezekiel 47. Yeah, you know, I just want to talk about Aaron's beard and the oil. Watch this, watch this. Are you with me? Watch this, watch this. Watch something. Watch something. Are you watching? Are you watching? Yeah, yeah, there's a revelation there. Are you there? Are you, are you, are you watching? Yeah, 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 yeah. The seven spirits of God. People think they are seven, but they are 18. Wow. Oh, yeah, there are 18 spirits of God. Oh, wow, wow. Hey, hey. I beg you. I'm not saying that they are 18. Just an example. I beg you. They don't know me. Those who prophesy my name. Those who handle the Lord. The priest, he didn't say, like, where is God? We are looking for God. Number two, those who handle the law. They don't know me. They don't know me. Oosh. And underline that. They that handle the law knew me not. I'm asking you, do you work for God? Do you work for God? You are the one he's talking about. Don't think that that work in itself, many of that group, he'll say to you, not that I knew you and then you stopped. 
I never knew you. It's not the same. I'm saying that some people are working for God and they feel that. Actually, I know God, but most, men, the, most of these people have missed the most important thing in life. They don't know God. The people working for God, they've missed something. They don't know God. Now, I'm coming. I'm going to teach you how to know God. If you stay, if you come every Friday, I'm going, I'm going, I'm not going to give you some theoretical. I'm going to tell you how you can become God's friend. I'm going to show you. But I want you to remove the deception from your life. Tell yourself the truth. I work for God, but I don't know God. I preach his word, but I don't know. 